Right, so today lads, we're going to be reviewing second in form, Bas Dost. Plays for Wolfsburg in the Bundesliga, 6 foot 5 tall, he's right footed, he's got medium low work rates, a 3 star weak foot and 2 star skills. Looking at his in games, his standout to his 99 heading accuracy, 94 attack positioning, 92 finishing, 91 shot power and 89 strength. We've also included all of the upgrades from his in-form version as a comparison for you so you can see each individual stat increase of each individual stat from his in-form version. So you can always pause the video for a closer look at any of these stats now. So this is the team we were using second in-form Dostin, a 4-2-3-1 Bundesliga team with Dost up top as a lone striker. So now onto the gameplay so you can see how second informed DOS was performing. Now we did review informed DOS a couple of weeks ago so we are in a good position to let you know how good second informed DOS is over informed DOS. So like his first inform, now he still doesn't have the pace, obviously, so that is why we are using him as a lone striker, as a target man, as I honestly think that is the best the, uh, position to deploy him in. And his heading is up to a maximum 99 heading, so he's an amazing heading, he is really dominant in the air. Now his jumping isn't too good, but he does have the 6 foot 5 height, so he doesn't really need to jump too much to get above defenders. And he still managed to get up for three headed finishes in the games we were playing, uh, even beating team of the season David Luiz in the earth. Shooting is awesome as well, 92 finishing and 91 shot power is really really good, and he did manage a better long shot this time around. Slight improvement on his long shot, still only 75, but still managed to get this one, absolutely smashes it in from distance, straight into the back of the net, leaves the keeper standing. So shooting wise, Dost is top notch in and outside of the box, and despite his low dribbling and agility, we still managed to get through a fair bit of players, keeping possession. Dribbling through some players now, obviously it is not the most uh, silky dribbling, it is clunky and slow, but we still managed to beat him and then finish it off right at the end. Does actually go with dribbling, for people who say you can't dribble or he's useless, you just have to practice, you just have to know how to use him. And he is like a battering ram up top, with his strength, his 89 strength and his size as well, it makes him great inside the box, whether it's bullying defenders for the ball, challenging, jumping for headers, uses his strength great in the box and also uses it well to slow down the play holding up the ball while he waits for his teammates obviously sometimes he does get a bit disjointed isolated up top so he is able to hold it up with his strength so let's have a look at second informed DOS performance stats so in six games he scored nine goals and got three assists all stats are on the left goals are on the right position map shows you where the goals are scored and assists were created as well so overall we're going to give second informed Dost an 8 out of 10, bit of an improvement over informed Dost. Now does have his 3 main plus points which obviously are his shooting, his strength and his aerial ability. I think this is why he should be a target man up front with all these strengths but you need to play to his strengths. It's cheap as well so I would go for the second informed version. Now what I'm really looking forward to is his team of the season card. He must be getting in the Bundesliga team of the season as he is on fire this season. One of, if not the most prolific strikers in Europe so far this season. So we're just going to leave you now with second informed dose, positives and negatives. So if you are looking at buying uh, Bass Dost, uh, don't hesitate, just go for the second inform. He is not that much more expensive than his inform and slightly better as well. Drop in now all the time, he probably will go under 15. Pick him up for a bargain, he'll rise after he's out of packs I'm sure. So hopefully you did enjoy the review, if you did please leave a like, it does help out a lot, we're trying to grow the channel as much as we can, we try to do the most in depth reviews on YouTube. So please check out all our other videos, subscribe if you're new to the channel, loads more to come so stay tuned for them, thanks a lot for watching, cheers lads and peace.